Are you a content creator looking for effects to improve your videos in 2021? Welcome to Production Crate. Production Crate is the resource for graphics, visual effects, music, and much more. On top of that, these assets are compatible with your editing software. Get your unlimited free effects today or premium effects for only $49 a year. Make it awesome. What is poppin' guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Now in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you exactly how to enable this community tab because actually in the past, I made around two to three videos about how to you know, enable it in 2018 and all that. But of course, YouTube constantly keeps making changes. They keep reducing the requirements, for example, and I always want to keep you guys updated on the latest requirements. So in today's video, the community tab is basically previously, it was the discussion tab. Right now, there are still a lot of questions, even a couple years later, Later about how to get this feature on your YouTube channel and still people also having these requirements and the criteria they still don't know how to get this tab enabled they don't see it pop up even though they have all the eligibilities right now in this video I also have one extra step that I've never shown in any video before about how to properly get this tab so if you guys are excited for this video make sure to smash the like button down below subscribe if you're here for the very first time watching I would say let's get this community tab enabled right after the intro Alright guys, so before we're gonna actually start getting into how to get this community tab enabled onto your channel, first we're gonna basically read about what is actually this tab, what it does, just for the people that are actually new to this channel and are also even new to this feature. So right here I'm on the YouTube help page and they say, community tab eligibility, creators with over a thousand subscribers have access to community posts. It will take up to one week to see the community tab after passing 1000 subscribers. The community tab may also be available to other channels as we continue testing this feature so I don't know if they're still testing because this article may be a couple years old but this basically comes down that you can even post videos onto your subscribers sub box you can post photos polls gifts anything like that so of course everybody wants this feature because let's say that you're not able to upload for quite a while but you still want to remain active you still want to interact with all your subscribers you can still push videos ask questions and so forth in the past videos I also showed you guys that the eligibility for this feature is 10,000 subscribers they actually lower that to about thousand subscribers which is a little bit more reasonable so of course with people that are commenting saying they have at least 1,000 subscribers and they still have the discussion tab on their channel nothing is changing let's go ahead and start moving on to what you can actually do to get this community tab it is a very very important that you will actually also meet the criteria make sure that your channel is also in good standing that you don't have any strikes because this can actually play a role if you're eligible or not so the next thing that we're gonna do is you need to make sure that your channel is on this custom layout so if it's not you want to go to your desktop and you want to change the layout so if you want to click on this little wheel you want to make sure that this feature is actually enabled where you you have this custom layout with the blue buttons like customize channel manage video so in this way it is way way easier to get this community tab of course because this can also be a part of the new layout so YouTube says after you pass 1,000 subscribers you will be able to have the community tab after about a one week in many cases that is not happening because I see tons of comments under these videos and I actually found one trick that you guys can use in order to enable this so what you need to do is the following so we want to make sure that you will listen carefully all right so I just want to take a quick second to talk about production crate this is not sponsored in any way this is just from personal experience because I've been using production crate for almost three years now using their effects their explosions their lower thirds their sound effects everything that you can imagine is on the website and they're literally adding new stuff day by day and actually on their Instagram they also show you how they make it by using some really cool behind the scenes clips on their page where you can see like how they create the explosions and how they model like 3d stuff it's really really cool so if you guys are interested in getting your high quality effects transparent without any backgrounds make sure to check out the link in the description over 90,000 people have already checked it out before you so make sure to go to the link in the description become a member of the community where you can ask your questions about editing about these effects it's really really cool to bring your videos to a next level and of course they're not only like lower thirds but they're also transitions that I use a lot make sure to hop over to the website if you're interested I would say let's continue with the video 
All right, guys, so as you can see right now, we are on my channel, on my phone, but you can also do this on your desktop, but it's way easier to show you guys this on my phone. So you guys can just watch this video and also follow along. So right here on my channel, at the very top right, you have these three dots. You wanna type down there, and then right here at the bottom, you see help and feedback. It says help and feedback, but it's basically Dutch, but you guys know what I try to say. You wanna tap on there. So then right here, it says support, and everything is Dutch, guys, but at the top, you see this loop icon, and it's says describe your problem so in that bar right here next to the loop we're gonna tap and we're going to type in community post okay so then we have these three options and you want to pick the second one which in your language or in English it will say communicate with viewers through community posts so we're gonna tap on there and then we will land on this page and then you want to basically scroll down and then at the bottom you see actually like was this helpful then you want to tap no at the bottom and then you want to write that your channel is basically not having this community tab. It has over a thousand subscribers. So I actually want to point out that if you're gonna write YouTube in this feedback section without a thousand subscribers, they're actually not gonna pay attention because you don't meet the criteria. But if you have a thousand subscribers or more and you actually don't see the tab, this is a function that you guys can use. But if you don't see all of these three dots, you just wanna basically go back to your YouTube channel and then at the top it says these three dots and then it says help and feedback. And then at the very bottom, on the main menu that we were just a minute ago, you see feedback. Right here, you can actually see your email address that is sending it from. And then right here, it says, do you have feedback? We would love to hear it. You can also reach out to here. So or you can also check out the help center. So right here, you would want to basically just fill in like, my channel is eligible for the community tab, but the tab does not appear. Can you please activate this tab onto my channel? Thanks. And then you can write your name and then you can click send. Of course, I'm not gonna click send right now because I already have the community tab. This is basically for people that are struggling to get the tab. So this is the method I was talking about at the beginning, guys. I've never showed this like sending feedback to YouTube because of course they will be checking the feedback. And then of course they will say like, oh, sorry, it's our mistake because sometimes the system is not really that accurate. They will literally give everybody the community tab with just a thousand subscribers. So of course, if YouTube checks the feedback that you sent, you have at least a thousand subscribers and your channel is in good state standing and all that. You don't necessarily even have to be a YouTube partner. Just have a thousand subscribers and a channel in good standing and send this feedback. Then of course, nine out of 10, after about five or even seven days, you will actually see the community tab on your channel pop up. It is that simple. So guys, that's it for this video. This is how you get the community tab onto your channel in 2021. A lot of things have changed from the criteria when it was like 10,000 subscribers at the beginning. They lowered it to a thousand, which is actually way, way more easy to get. So that's it guys if you guys find this video helpful make sure to roll it with a like down below also let me know down in the comments if you have the tab or not did you have issues getting it or how long did it take and that's it guys thanks a lot for the continued support and i'll see you guys obviously in the next video